Hi and welcome to this um, Shadow of Mordor photo tutorial. Very quick and easy. Make sure the first thing you do is go into settings and enable it, game settings on the main menu. Then if you're on a controller, which I am, you press your left thumbstick in or P. This just goes to show how stupid um, the orcs are that he's seen me. Red arrow above his head. And then all I do is sort of move around. And he's... Where's he gone? Where's he gone? And brutal. And there you go. Left click. And then you get this overlay up here. With loads of options. So this vignette option is kind of like closing the camera angle round. So you can sort of see the black edges here and down here sort of like a black kind of oval circle and you've got intensity that uh, I'm not really too sure what that does to be honest with you you've got your different frames ground texture the frame there that's you can see all the kind of almost like black lightning around the edge this is like this grunge effect that I've got on there there are other frames as well your depth of field if you know anything about photography I think I don't but I think depth of field is how blurred the background is, how far you can see beyond the center point of the camera. I've got my field of view here, so I'll move that around. I think I'll leave it there. You can see there's a nice kind of cut down the photograph. I like that. And then you've got all your Instagram type filters. It's a shame it doesn't have like, you know, an 80s retro. I'm sure someone will mod that at one point or the 70s, yeah, the classic Instagram type thing. So yeah, cycle through those, choose the one you like. Um, I believe I liked warm in the end. And um, that's just making sure, that's it, open up a little bit more. You can see that it goes to sort of like a rectangle. I've got bars at the top of the bottom and I've got my frame. I like that frame and change the texture. I believe I end up with canvas. I like the kind of painted canvas look. There it is. And once you're kind of done with that, you press um, you know, triangle if it's PlayStation. Oh, sorry, you can do the logos, as you can see there. I'll keep that one. Then you press the triangle button or the Y button if you've got the Xbox controller to get rid of the overlay. And then you hit F12, as you can see. Just hit F12. And view screenshots. There it is. What we've just done. Give it a name. I think I'll call this one brutal as it's you know as I was being quite brutal with it and upload and there you go and then shift tab get rid of your steam overlay because that's do its thing however long that's going to take doesn't matter you can play on and then left left stick again carry on into the game so I hope that was of use to you have fun playing around with it I know I will and uh, you know if you like this kind of thing you know what to do you know click like and you know and subscribe and all those kind of things tell your friends etc etc all right thanks a lot bye bye